just down to the bottom there. Okay. Kind of close to here, look. For the IP. So probably uh, let's stay on this ridge and we'll go over to where their dip site is. We can get some uh, pictures of them dipping and then we can follow okay. them back out for when they drop. There's no keys coming back across here. I will switch as soon as they come back off. We had done this, uh, the Colorado Aviation Summit was something that had been intentionally put in place kind of years ago uh, to help develop the relationship between the National Guard and a lot of the other uh, entities around Colorado. Uh, the United States Forest Service, the BLM, uh, the Bureau of Indian Affairs, the Colorado Division of Fire Prevention and Control, multiple local fire departments, um, jurisdictions, counties, um, recognizing that uh, there's a really powerful group of um, folks and resources here and that's the National Guard. They're a very uh, task and multi-diverse sort of uh, group and they do all kinds of stuff and one of the things that they requested was to for some further training was how to effectively communicate with firefighters on the ground and get some practice dropping water uh, utilizing buckets onto uh, wildland fires. So we created a large simulation. This was back in May of this year. We were out at Longmont. We worked at um, Button Rock Reservoir with many of the same units that are here today. Same aircraft, same flight crews. Um, so there's a personal relationship now with the folks in the air and many of the folks on the ground. I, I personally worked with many of these folks through that training. Um, and what it looked like just being up the road or just north of us a little bit was a very similar fuel model. They were dipping out of a large reservoir, Button Rock Reservoir. They were talking to folks on the ground, simulated divisions, and all the pieces and parts of a wildland fire existed in that scenario, except the smoke and flames. So now, it all comes together, they have the smoke and flames, and everything makes sense. And so they've really incorporated incredibly smoothly into the effective firefighting mission that's going on on the Cold Springs Fire. Go on. 